Hey guys, what's up? My name is Taylor. Welcome to my channel. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. If you do comment, leave some ideas for further videos. Due to this being a new channel, I'm still picking up on things, figuring out what what to do, especially while stuck in quarantine. We all need a little something to fill the time. So with today's video, we are gonna go over what I got this season in my Fit Fun Box which will be fun and exciting. The unfortunate thing is I did have to already take the items out of the box due to all the mailing and everything with Corona. They suggest that you immediately throw away the outer parts of packages due to the virus potentially being able to stay on there. So I did unfortunately partially see everything, but we have not really gone in depth on it at all. I've not really looked at it. I just pulled it out of the box and put it in a pile next to me. So with that being said, welcome. I hope you guys enjoy. And if you have a FabFitFun box, leave a comment and say what was your favorite part of your seasonal box because I know that most of them are different. A lot of them are also the same due to the limited items that go in them, but I'd love to hear about what some other people are getting as well. So. That being said, let's dive in. Hey guys, so for item number one, we do have this spray right here. So this looks to be a hydrating spray or something along those lines. The instructions say, spray a fine mist on your skin and wait for a few minutes then gently pat dry so I'll probably do a little bit more research on this just to figure out what exactly its purpose is and what it is I've honestly never heard of the brand but it's a ooh thermometer so it says soothing and anti-irritating so I'm gonna assume that it is for something along those lines the next item we have is going to be this which from the looks of it is a body oil it says that it has rosewood and litsy cubeba body oil with mang mangango and pomegranate oil sorry if i just totally massacred that but we're doing our best with pronunciation as we go as well because like i said i have not really looked at these nor have i heard of some of them so it's just a learning process for the both of us. Um, body oil sounds great, looks great. Kind of want to smell it. So, with that said, why don't we just open her up and just put some on the back of my hand. All right, so just right off the bat, I can't really smell anything, but we're gonna just do a nice, as you guys are going through this with me. Go. Just put a little bit on the back of my hand, nothing crazy. Gotta do this. Ooh, so for someone that loves essential oils, I think that this smells wonderful, honestly. I really like this. The rosewood in it is really prominent and I appreciate that. So, with that being said, on to the next. So our next product is gonna be something called, it's called Fast Food. And it is a moisturizer as you can say, see, but it is for your hair, it's a hair moisturizer. It's a leave-in conditioner and it says that apply a quarter sized amount on clean damp hair, focus on ends and comb through, do not rinse. So basically this is just a leave-in conditioner. I honestly wanna smell this too just because smelling stuff when they get it. That misting spray, I don't know, just because I really just don't know what that is, but this. Okay, this is gonna sound so crazy, but it smells kind of like bubble gummy. Obviously like not a kid's bubble gum, but flavor like overwhelming, but it smells sweet. I don't know, I can't quite put my finger on it, but I like it. Something I wouldn't mind putting on my hair, but it could also be mixing with that oil that we had just put on our hands. So, with that, on to the next. So, the next is gonna be Deep Sleep or Deep Sleep Body Cocoon. 
and this looks to be a it says a multitasking sleep savior for better nights and brighter mornings um, it's a lotion essentially that you put on it says use nightly after bathing and before bedtime to restore and nourish skin while you sleep this is something I definitely am gonna try out maybe today potentially maybe tomorrow who knows but we're gonna smell it because why not and if somebody has already tried these products pre please leave below if you liked them or not my nails are making this really complicated sorry to disappear I got a pair of tweezers to peel this off because I'm just really struggling with actual nails Ooh, this smells like it's got lavender in it, which is, ooh, as we all pretty much know, is a really great, oh my god, is really great when it comes to helping you sleep better. Yep, it does. It says it's got the pure essential oils of lavender, vetivert, and chamomile to help you sleep, so. We'll be trying that out and maybe I'll do another video which is like reviewing all the products once I've actually tried them all but we will see next item that I have is silicone straws love that the full bloom connect collection so obviously the title is pretty self self-explanatory they're gonna be some silicone straws so cute they come with a cute little like pill bottle looking, it honestly does kind of look like a medicine pill, but this is going to be a little container to bring the straw places, whatever, we might as well just open one and see how well it fits. I love pink, so we're going to do pink straw, and it does also come with this lovely little spoolie for being able to clean inside of it, which is a little bit difficult, but but love that live for it so for the straw I'm assuming you could easily just bend it like so just bend it I'll do it on camera like this then open handy dandy little bottle and voila transportable straw I love these I already have a reusable straw that I use typically when we were able to go out but this is awesome and all the little colors are so cute super cute very spring faint we're on a roll we've got this Donny cardigan this was something that I actually chose to get because you can go online and you can choose a few items that you get this is the only one that really stands out to me otherwise these bag but I'd really been like no I want that so this is just a really nice simple cardigan thought it looked cute in the picture the girl was super happy wearing it so why not very cute super 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 lightweight very thin nice for like summer I like that the sleeves aren't to the full length but at the same time like well it's just kind of cute nice around the house cardigan it does have pockets on both sides so just a nice easy lightweight maybe you go to the beach or just hang out around the house cardigan nothing crazy I'm gonna take it off because it is a little bit toasty in here and I want to wash it so next we have a gravity sleep mask. And so this is actually a weighted sleeping mask. And I already do have a sleep mask that I typically use. It's just a plain little black one, but this one it seems it is pretty heavy, honestly. I wonder, I'm not gonna put it on. Maybe I'll see. Put it on. It is very soft. I'm sure if I zoom, you could tell that the material is kind of like that fuzzy blanket that we all love. Um, it does have an adjustable strap, so you can literally fit it however you want. <laughs> I did put on makeup, so that's the only reason I'm not quick to just throw it over my face. 
topic for the video we go. Huh. I like it. I definitely feel like once you're laying down and it's like flat and evenly dispersed on your face, that's the way to have it. So this is another thing that when I come back with another video, maybe I'll do a review and we'll do an update on it. But this is gonna be by the brand Gravity and it's just a weighted sleeping mask. And the beads weigh up to one pound. All right, and then our final, final, final item, which is the second thing that I know for sure that I did choose for this season is these Cal Pack packing bags. Uh, we're gonna open this actually before I just go zooming in. And there was two different styles of these bags that you could get. I went with the Sherbert looking ones just cause these colors are so freaking cute. So this is the bags that I chose. The back, you can see the colors a little bit better. So, so, so pretty, like a little freaking sunset. But there are three bags and they are all stacked inside of each other. So we've got bag number one. They're apparently like the perfect travel bag. So we've got travel bag two. And then finally, number three, which is so cute. And they've all got this really pretty like Sherbert sunset thing going, which I absolutely love. And I'm so excited to use these once we are all out of this lockdown. I saw in some videos that people actually did pack them and then they would stack them inside of each other. But I don't know, we'd see how that works just depending on how tall or how much stuff that you want to put in them. But I think that overall they're just really cute and it's just really nice to have like three bags. They all do have handles, which is lovely as well. It's just a really easy way to honestly pack your stuff. And if you're going with more than one person or like a friend's trip, then, oh, my bags are the ones that all look the same. So it's just for easy organization. As for that, um, that's about it for my Fabfit Fun Box of this season. I hope that everybody's doing well with this quarantine. Like I said, leave comments for video ideas and suggestions. I can't just be playing Switch all the time and laying in bed. So here's the start of the new hobby. For now, I hope that you did enjoy. And like I said, if you have Fabfit Fun Box and you did get different items or you did get the same items, just leave a review or say what you got. And we can just all connect with that because we're all just bored at home sitting on the internet for the most part. So why not? through that. Thanks for staying through the whole video if you have. And I look forward to the next one. So, bye.